Hi there, good afternoon and welcome to today's Kingston Library Teen Book Review. I'm Fran and today I'm going to be talking about The Loneliest Girl in the Universe by Lauren James. I have read um, and reviewed another Lauren James book called The Quiet at the End of the World, which I recommend you go and check out on our YouTube channel. But um, the book that I'm talking about today is The Loneliest Girl in the Universe and that is the first book I read by her and it totally blew me away. It's a teen science fiction book but it's definitely not um, not as it appears when you first start to read it. The cover is stunning and there's largely for 99% of the book there's just one character and I think it's a testament to Lauren James's writing ability that makes the book never get boring, it never gets dull, you never kind of think when is there another character going to pop up, when is something going to happen. You're very interested all the way through in the main character's journey and what's happening to her and what's going to happen. It's all a great mystery that's tied together really well. It's so interesting and I'll tell you a little bit about the plot. Um, so the main character is a young lady named Romy, Romy Silvers, who is the only um, surviving crew member of a spaceship which has been sent out to a planet light years away in order to help um, make a settlement, a human settlement on a different planet. Um, it's quite complicated but the reason that she is the only survivor left is because she was born on the spaceship and um, you know her parents and all the other crew members are now gone and that's part of the mystery and you'll, you'll gradually begin to learn why that's happened. Um, but Romy is the only person left and she has to run the ship herself she has to um you know keep everything working keep everything in good working order and um she's totally and completely on her own she does get messages from earth however because she's now so far away she's you know light years away from earth the messages can take months to arrive and her replies take months to go back and so these conversations you know, they're several months away from each individual message. And so she's very much on her own with, you know, just with a big spaceship. And it's it's very interesting as to, you know, you get to have to try and unravel the mystery as to why this the way it is the way it is. Um, until one day she starts receiving more messages from a man named Jay, who claims to be on another spaceship which left not too long after hers and um, that they are receiving messages that Earth is in trouble, that there is a big war erupting on Earth. And that is why, you know, soon Romy stops receiving her messages from Earth and that's because there's this big war happening. And so Jay becomes her sole companion and her and Jay begin to message each other and because Jay's ship is more advanced he is a bit faster and so he is slowly catching up and so she's finally going to have someone with her for the first time in years and so she and Jay get to know each other through these messages that get closer and closer together as they get closer together um, and you know their messages take months to transmit but you know R Romy begins to fall so close with Jay and they form such a close bond but you know as things go on you begin to realize maybe things aren't what they seem it's such a really gripping story um you really need to read it it's such a gripping mystery mystery book and it you know comes quite a thriller towards the end it is really really great i'll just read the blurb for you so Romy Silvers is the only surviving crew member of a spaceship travelling to a new planet on a mission to establish a second home for humanity. Alone in space, she is the loneliest girl in the universe until she hears about a new ship which has launched from Earth, with a single passenger on it on board, a boy called Jay. Their only communication is via email, and due to the distance between them, their messages take months to transmit, and yet Romy finds herself falling in love. Can you fall in love with someone you've never met, never even spoken to, someone who is light years away? But what does Romy really know about Jay? What do the mysterious messages which have been started arriving from Earth really mean? Sometimes there is something worse than being alone. 
So that is the book review for today. That is The Loneliest Girl in the Universe by Lauren James. Please do check it out online um, or reserve it from one of our libraries which are operating, operating Ready Reads at the moment if you can. Um, and I hope to uh, hear if anyone else has read, uh, has read the, this book. So please let us know what you think. Thank you for watching. Bye.